Welcome to Weekly Entertainment. This is our first uh, podcast of Weekly Entertainment. And uh, to get started, we're going to give you a little overview of the show. Um, we are going to change up the golf into videos until we go to the TV station, so for now we'll probably do some Mike Dolo tip, or I might change it to like a cooking thing where we cook food instead. We'll do the driving tips as planned. We got enough to make it through the few weeks before we start production for the TV series. We also get to move with the random video of the day. In just a few seconds, we are going to go to a video that will get into deeper details about the show and a little and information about it. So we are going to uh, go to that video right now. This is uh, a quick little video um, about the show and we're going to get details about the show and then in open form and then we're also going to give a little information about me and how I came up with this idea. So we're going to uh, get started with information here. Uh, I, my name is Ian Smith as I said before. I am 19. I was born in November of 92. First thing that uh, most people can get confused about is the appearance. The age appearance is a lot uh, younger than you guys might actually think. Um, sometimes I might be mistaken for 14, maybe 15 years old. And I'm uh, only 19, so get them a lot. A lot. A lot of the times I get that. And um, I've been at a young age diagnosed with autism, high functioning autism, which does have a reason behind me each thing and a lot of speaking. I'm not doing it right now for this video. It takes a while to even get started with the video. So that's that and a little wrap there. Uh, I came up with the show like a few weeks ago and it was originally going to be something else but then I decided to change it. It seemed a little bit more better than Entertainment Weekly. It is now been Weekly Entertainment, I think, for the last two, four weeks now. And it's, it's the first uh, video for the first episode. I don't know, I have a video before thinking about switching that out to a cooking segment. We might do that with the TV show too, depending on how things go. And plus, we'll also cover other things in the show that we're going to go over, like right now in this video. Uh, we plan to cover the show. Well, first airs, I think the studio said three weeks. After the taping date, I'll double check with that. If it is, that will be the end of July or beginning of August before the first episode is on the TV station. Uh, so, we did the plan three weeks in advance. So, like, for the 
the Dream Cruise, which is normally the third weekend in August. We had to start saying things about that in the middle of July, so it would be the time for the the uh, run to come up. The uh, Dream Cruise would be straight on within two days of it. The only problem with that is it would be probably about six weeks before we get video from the Dream Cruise because then by the time we get to the Dream Cruise episode we'll probably be it would only be three weeks into September that uh, that video would come out because we're only in there once a week there's like four to five weeks in a month. So, uh, once it, the show gets started, it'll be easier. I also do live band things, not live, probably possibly live just once a year. Uh, but we have to get with the studio some days in events beforehand. I gotta make up the schedule and stuff for the station because we're not the only show that airs there. Won't be airing there. They service 11 communities in the uh, county, so we're not the only person that's using that group that's using that station. We'll cover like the events around the uh, Try the area like the drum crews and stuff, and try to get bands to come on the show. Groups of people, even single uh, forms of people in the group, like one person for an interview kind of show. We do have a website up and running, and we will do that. If you live in the Detroit area, Detroit, Michigan. That's what that website is for. Even if you don't live in the area and you want to fly in, you can do that too. Just be aware of that one in the Detroit area. And our website is weeklyentertainment.webs.com. And to uh, be on the show, we're not going to do this for the web, but we will do this starting probably the third or fourth week in because I want fourth weekend because I'm not going to get things settled beforehand. Do three episodes, do a behind the scenes episode, have that be the third one, one fourth or fifth. And it might be close to the dream cruise, but we'll sort things out. The forms are on the guest information, under the guest information tab on the website. The website again is weeklyentertainment.webs.com. There's a web form for bands, groups, and single, just a single person form. And I took one on the build the sites up. There are parts of it that aren't filled in here because we're not at the TV station yet. Once we get there, we'll fill that part out. I think I just covered the whole thing. We plan to uh, videotape each episode on Monday. We're going to try, I'm going to try to work out some schedule to get into the TV station every Monday, a Tuesday, Monday for recording, Tuesday for editing, Wednesday I'll just rest, Thursday I'll go back in, drop off the CD the form and come home and do that every week. We can maybe take out cameras over for the weekend so we can do the driving tip stuff and the uh, golf tip stuff. If I going to do that, I think we will for the TV, just not the web, because the web's only going to be for a few weeks before we'll stop web. The last show will be a live webcast on the stream. Using the Channel 16 News uh, Eastern Council, if you go to channel16news.webs.com in a few weeks, hopefully I'll let you know each week when we get closer. 
weather forecast when we do the live every year and uh, we'll do it at the end of each season which will be at the end of the full year of the show so we start one and the first broadcast airs on the August 5th on Thursday August 5th the next year the first week closest the first day closest to the 5th on a Thursday we'll be on live show which means we'll have to work out a schedule and we'll have to skip some uh, about a week of production and then you're back into it the next week for the week before and after the live event and we'll have to see because we have to also get in on that day of live show well, decide if we want to do that or not. It's going to be hard to uh, the uh, show because we tape one week, but then it takes another two or three weeks before playing back because they got to go through a system at the station. So, um, that's um, basically our show. And, uh, Updates along the way. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that little quick video. Um, just to recap, we are going to still do the three videos in the day, which will take up about most of the time. Then we'll be talking in the middle between each video, between the driving tips before and after the driving tips, before and after the golf tips or the cooking, depending on what we want to do. Then before the definitely before the last video, there might be some times where we are going to end up going over. We want to cut it short, so we're not going over the time. We'll just say something like, "We're about done here," and hope you enjoyed this uh, broadcast. We'll see you next week. But before we sign off, we're going or not like that, but. We'll figure out something like that to sign up to. Uh, enjoy this. Hope you enjoyed this uh, newscast. We're going to sign off. And uh, we'll leave you with this random video of the day. We'll see something like that instead of the normal. I'm about to sign off. But before we do, we want to show you this random video clip of the day. Hope you enjoyed this clip. Then after that, we come out and say, okay. Um, that's all we have time for today. Hope you enjoyed this. Breakfast. We'll see you next week and we'll say something like that if we have time. We'll only do that if the video's longer. The video will be longer than a minute, but we, we might be going over because some of the, sometimes driving tips or any of the other videos might go over 10 minutes. And she does cut into the time to in the intro we'll also start we're not going to uh, have much of the web because uh, uh, just don't have enough time we're not going to be doing that many episodes on the web like I said in the video we are going to um, do a few weeks of this on the web up until I can get a crew for the show and then go to the TV studio and start a production there and there will be a live broadcast on Ustream on Channel 16 News uh, that won't be called Channel 16 News, it will be called Weekly Entertainment it will be on the Channel 16 News, my Channel 16 News website which is W www.channel16news.webs.com 
and uh, the stream is on the home page and there will be things up on the stream as well. Uh, I think that's basically it uh, for a recap there. Uh, we do have a website also. I guess we're not done with the recap. Uh, like I said, uh, Single people, uh, single like single like you don't have a girlfriend or boyfriend. Single, but if you're by yourself, you want to talk about something, you can do that. Uh, just go to uh, weeklyentertainment.webs.com and click on the guest information tab. And under that, there are subtitles for a group, band, and single guests. Again, single guest doesn't mean like single single just means you're by yourself and you want to talk about something. And I will get back to you and we're only going to do that for the TV series since we're not going to do that for the web so you're anyone's welcome or at the stations in southeastern Michigan so you, if you're out of the area you'd have to fly in that can be sometimes hard, so it's easier if the groups and the bands and the people around of the Detroit area, Michigan, uh, fill out the group and band and some contest forms because they're in the area and they're not going to be days out or something. Uh, we're going to uh, start with our second video right now. We're going to uh, be going to a driving test video. And we'll be on the cut to the video. Now up ahead, we're going to turn left into the uh, school here. And we're going to show turning right. You come out. Um, right now the light isn't active, but if it was, well, it would be a lot better. But you can see lines on the roads. There's a little break in between the white and yellow line. That's where you want to go. In. Not before, not after. Now, since this is a flashing red light, we stop at the line. Then we move up. And we get to see off it. That also goes for the light is working and it's blinking also. You stop before, and then you proceed when it's Basically, broken. Now, what we're going to do now is back up, and I'm going to show you a right turn at the light up here. So, we're just basically turning around. There's nobody in this parking lot, so I'm clear. Those white dashed lines are no parking, also, and so is the handicap. Handicap are for handicapped people only. The white dashed lines are no parking at all. Solid double lines mean no pathing on either side. If there's a dashed line on one side and a straight saw line on one side and the other, the dash side can pass with safe only. If both, if there's a middle lane, if there's one, if there's a dashed yellow, both sides can pass with safe. Now in the right turn lane, you can 
not go straight across here. You can get pulled over if somebody sees you get the cops and you do that. Also on the right turn lane, if the light is blinking, which it is, stop before mm -hmm. or at the line and inch up. If there's no turn on if there's a no turn on red sign, don't turn unless the light's green or there's a narrow green arrow. If there's no light no turn on red and light sign, then you can do the same thing I just did there. Stop before the line, then inch up, then when it's safe to go. Let's just wait for the light. It did some more road work up here. But um, we'll see that for uh This is Corey's milkshake. Kind of. It's got more ice in it than anything else. <laughs> Ew. That's disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> that does not look ice cream. like. That does not look like a milkshake. It's just ice covered in ice cream. <laughs> yeah, with a little bit of milk that was left <laughs> over. Oh, well, that's just disgusting. You're just jealous. Yeah! <laughs> and how are you supposed to drink? Oh, I mean, eat that! Oh, like that. Oh, like. <laughs> <laughs> Here comes the rest of it. <laughs> I think it's that's mine? <laughs> no way, man. <laughs> well, that was a waste of. The rest of the ice cream. So my mom gets how much you tell her that you tried to make a milk shake and that turned out to be a disaster. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. She looks at that one. <laughs> God, that looks like a milk shake. Kind of. <laughs> Man, that's my <laughs> oh, so I get the big one. Huh? Oh, no, I don't. You eat all that. Never mind. You can have it both. Hope you enjoyed this newscast, and uh, we'll see you next week. Bye.